At Audiology Associates of Prestonsburg, you can live your life the way you want and find the freedom of better hearing. With 40 years of being in the hearing care industry, you'll experience patient care that is specific to you with exceptional follow-up care that ensures your hearing and balance needs are being met. Audiology Associates at 1428 North Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. Lieutenant Governor Jacqueline Coleman joined local leaders in McGoffin County today to announce more than $420,000 in funding for safer roads and infrastructure in McGoffin County. The funding will be used to resurface portions of Bull Creek Road, Hammonds Fork Road, and Meredith Branch Road, and purchase a skid steer loader for the county's solid waste department. In eastern Kentucky, many of our roads haven't been resurfaced in years, in decades. Uh, these roads here, they were paved in the 80s. So these folks have been living on these roads and they are continuing to deteriorate in disrepair. And, and as I said earlier, this makes their life a little easier. When you live on one of these county rural roads and it's blacktop, it's broken up, it's potholes, it's, it's just a rough ride, uh, it's not safe for students on buses, it's just, it, it, this, this right here is just a blessing to us to be able to get these types of funds. Over the past three years, McGoffin County has received $1.4 million from the Commonwealth, assisting the county to resurface over 20 roadways. The big projects get a lot of attention, and rightfully so, because it's a big deal to know that we're going to four-lane the Mountain Parkway, that we're going to build the Brent Spence Companion Bridge, that we're going to open up the I-69 corridor in the west. All of those are great. Um, but when you think about the rural roads that our families drive on, that our buses travel, um, you know, those are the, the roads that folks are on every single day in their community. They're not passing through. You know, it's not like a, a, a semi that drives through to go somewhere else. This is where you live. And so we want to make sure that we're keeping our rural roads um, up to date, but also as safe as we can. Safety is another huge issue for our families, I know. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.